Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video, I'm gonna do my skincare routine. I will be having two skincare routines up on my channel. One will be daytime and another one will be nighttime. And for today's video, we are gonna do my daytime skincare routine. This video will be separated into two. One is where I will be explaining to you guys the products that I use. The second part of the video is where I will be demonstrating the products on my face. So you will see my whole entire routine. Starting off with cleanser. I've been using this cleanser. It's the Aveeno... Avino? It's the Avino Clear Complexion Foaming Cleanser. Um, it says that it's for clear, even looking skin. It helps prevent breakouts. It has moisture rich soy extract and it also has salicylic acid to treat the blemishes and acne and stuff like that. Another good thing about this product is that it is oil free, it's soap free, it's non comedogenic and it's hypoallergenic. My skin have been really really liking this cleanser a lot. Um, you guys know that I've been using the simple moisturizing cleanser for a really long time but um, I've been having like breakouts here and there and I wanted to give this a go so yeah i've been loving this so far my skin has been clearing up a lot and it has really helped with my acne and blemishes and all that due to the salicylic acid and all the good stuff it is very foamy all you need to do is to just have two pumps and that is enough sometimes i even use one and a half pumps depending on my skin if i have a lot of makeup then I probably wanted to use two pumps but mostly I'll use only one and a half pumps if I do not have makeup especially in the morning so yeah this is my cleanser after cleansing my skin I like to um, scrub my lips because I have really dry lips so I need to scrub it every single day both day and night and the lip scrub that I've been using for a really long time now is from Lush and it's the Min Julips lip scrub and this is what it looks like you guys know I've talked about this quite a lot in my videos and you know the drill just scrub it on your lips it takes away your dead skin dead cells and everything and then you can rinse it off or you can wipe it off but what i like to do is just lick it off because it is edible to be honest because this is natural all natural stuff and yeah you can lick it off if you want because i don't know it's very pepperminty obviously because it says mint lips it's very pepperminty which also helps in your breath so your breath smells really good <laughs> After all that, I pat my face dry and then I move on to toning my skin. I have um, three toners to share with you guys. One is my all-time favorite simple soothing facial toner and this is what it looks like. It doesn't have any scent to it. It's non oily at all it's very soothing it's very gentle to the skin so if you have sensitive skin this toner would be really really good for you another toner is from lush and it's the tea tree water toner and this is what it looks like it smells like tea tree obviously and um what it does is that it tones the skin as well as combating the blemishes and acne and all that so this is really good stuff also another thing about this toner is that you can also spot treat your acne if you have like little tiny acne and all that kind of stuff you can just spray on your fingers and then you just dab it in and there you go spot treatment on the go another toner that i've been loving and i've been using for quite a while is this toner it's a homemade toner what i do is I put 50% water and 50% apple cider vinegar and then you just shake it up and then you just spritz it on the cotton pad and then you just wipe it around your whole entire face. I really like this toner because uh, again it was, it's something like the tea tree one it helps to kill your acne and all that kind of stuff and also it helps to soothe the skin and it it makes my skin a lot cleaner so that is what I really like about this. and. Furthermore, you don't have to spend much money because it's very cheap. All you have to do is just add in water and add in apple cider vinegar and there you go, your all natural homemade toner. The reason why we add 50% apple cider vinegar and 50% water is because you want to... I wouldn't say you want to neutralize it but you don't want to add too much um, apple cider vinegar because it will be too acidic to your skin and it it will just damage your skin so you must always add 50% water to balance the solution out moving on to moisturizers after I toned my skin I apply my eye cream and the eye cream that I've been using um, at the moment is from Tarte and is the Maracuja C Brightener Eye Treatment and this is what it looks like um, 
this is the sample size i just want to try it out and so far i've been really liking this because it's very um it's not thick at all it's very gentle under the eye and it brightens my eye so that is why i like and yeah if you have dark circles this might help you i will i will update you guys on whether this thing is bomb or not i move on to apply my daily moisturizer and the moisturizer that i've been using every single day is from avino you guys know you have seen this a thousand times and is the avino smudge smudge is the avino smart essentials daily nourishing moisturizer with spf 30 and this is what it looks like um i wouldn't go too in depth on this because i've talked about this like a lot um what i would say is that it has vitamin a c and e um it protects your skin from the sun obviously because it has spf 30 um it is oil free once again it's hypoallergenic and it's non-comedogenic which is really really good and that is what my skin really likes and it's very gentle it sinks into the skin really well so yeah it makes it just protects your skin and evens your skin tone well so yeah moving on to acne treatments um it doesn't matter whether it's daytime or nighttime i will still treat my acne if i have and if i do i will use the um acne clear pimple treatment cream and this is what it looks like so yeah, I basically just dab it on the affected areas and then I just dab it in and there you go. So to top off my whole entire daytime skincare routine, I will always apply lip balm. And the lip balm that I really really like is from Vaseline or I would just use Vaseline itself. And um, another good lip balm that I like to use is on the body shop because that is a really good one because it's pretty thick and it helps to moisturize your lips that concludes my daytime skincare routine and um it depends on the week um usually once a week i will always um scrub my skin and if i do i will use the lush ocean salt facial scrub and this is what it looks like this is what it looks like i think i've talked about this with you guys and yeah all i would say is that it's very gentle um it is the only facial scrub that i will ever use because it's so gentle and it doesn't break me out and um yeah because so far um other facial scrubs that i've tried it always breaks my skin out and my skin just hates it so yeah usually in a week i will scrub my skin two to three times per week so yeah to take away all the junk and the dead skin and cells and whatever is on your face so yeah that is a really really good facial scrub if you haven't tried go ahead and try because you will love it and it will make your skin really clean and smooth smooth like baby skin that is all for my daytime skincare routine i will put down all the products that i've mentioned in this video down in the description box if you guys are interested to check them out and all that kind of good stuff um all my social media websites will be down in the description box give this video a thumbs up if you guys like this video comment down below anything or any questions if you have um pertaining to any of the products and stuff like that or you can just find me on my social media that is all i have to say thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next week for my nighttime skincare routine bye